that's what you would have seen on Friday if it wasn't so cloudy. Um, yeah, so what well, maybe less than an hour after the moon has risen, I'm facing east toward ish. And note carefully which side of the moon is lit. Um, make sure to orient yourself with respect to the ground. So one thing I'll, I think I can highlight today that'll show the importance of making sure you orient yourself. So in this view, you see that the side of the moon that's closer to the ground is lit. Now watch, in the same day. And the moon is at the directly due south, so at the highest point, point in the sky. So I'm zooming so that you can see the moon phase. Um, if anything, you would say that the side that's laid is the left side of moon, but that's not how I want you to record it. I want you to identify which side is to which side is west. Um, I think when you're looking directly due south, it's a little bit easier. You can almost uh, imagine that if you're looking directly due south, then um, your left is east, your right is west. So uh, if the left side of the moon is lit, then that's the east side that's lit. Okay, let me advance the time until when the moon is about to set. Or Okay, yeah, I think that's good enough. So again, note the cardinal points. We are looking west toward here. And note which side of moon is lit. Now it's side away from ground. Um, but if you oriented yourself properly, um, according to east to west, um, this should remain the consistent side that's lit. Okay. 